did you ever wonder what time is? I mean, not the question, what time is it? That's an easy question. Just have a look at your phone or your watch or a clock. No, I mean, what is time itself? Is it something real, something imaginary? Is time a human invention? Is there a clock ticking in the universe? Can time be turned back? Hello, wherever you are in the world, and welcome to this course about Aristotle's concept of time. The questions we just raised are old philosophical questions. To answer them, we need to have a look at what some ancient thinkers had to say about them. The most important of these ancient philosophers was Aristotle. Aristotle lived in ancient Greece in the 4th century BC. He laid the foundation for many philosophical discussions that have remained relevant ever after, even today, 24 centuries later. So what did Aristotle have to say about time? In this course, we will explore five key questions about time. First, the paradoxical nature of time. If the past is gone and future is not there yet, then how can time exist? Except for the indivisible present instant, which we call now. So, does time exist? The second question concerns the word now. Is the now always the same? Or is it always changing? How can a series of indivisible moments add up to an interval of time? Next, we will discuss the relation between time and change. In everyday life, we use time as a measurement of change. So can we regard time itself as some kind of change? Is time, for instance, the same as the movement of the sun or the stars? That's the third question we will explore. The fourth question deals with the objective existence of time. Suppose there were no human beings on Earth and there were no one who could think and no one who could understand time. Then would time still exist? If humanity would go extinct on some fateful day, would time cease to be as well? Or is time some clock that is ticking in the background of the universe? The fifth and final question is about the direction of time. Suppose that time exists, then do moments of time ever come back? Or should we rather think that the past is gone forever? In philosophical terms, is time circular or is it linear? These, then, are the five questions that we will explore in this online course. I hope that they will inspire you as much as they may perplex you while you dive into them. And I wish you happy learning.